So you knew the vertex was negative one, negative nine. It opens up because this is a positive two. The axis of symmetry is a line that cuts it in half. And that's a vertical line. And vertical lines are uh, x equals, so it's x equal negative one. And then the next thing is find the x-intercepts. Well, the x-intercepts are where y equals zero. So I think I'll use this form here. So to find your x-intercept, let y be zero. So it's going to be zero equals 2x squared plus 4x minus 7. And I don't know if that will factor or not, so I'm just going to use a quadratic formula. Um, and you know, it may be easier if we use this form. I think it will be. Let's do 0 equals 2 x plus 1 squared minus 9. So add 9 to both sides. So that's 2 x plus 1 squared equals a positive 9. That's x plus 1 squared equals 9 over 2. And now take the square root of both sides. And of course, that's going to give me plus or minus. So that leaves me x plus 1 equals, the square root of 9 is 3 over the square root of 2. Of course, it's plus or minus. And we do not want to leave a, a radical on the bottom. So let's rationalize it by multiplying top and bottom by square root 2. So that gives me plus or minus 3 square root of 2 all over 2. Because square root 2 times square root 2, I keep hitting the wrong thing, is that. So x plus 1 equals plus or minus 3 square roots of 2 over 2. And now let's subtract this 1 from both sides. And that gives me x equals negative 1 plus or minus 3 square roots 2 over 2. And then the y-intercept, uh, you've got correct. Of course, the y-intercept is where x is where x equals 0, and that would be negative 7.